Hello everyone, in this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to use groups in Godot 4. So let's say I have two enemies, I have a phantom and I have a skeleton. These are both enemies, so we can put them into a group to call functions on them or do other actions with them together. So, hover to here, groups, I'll create a new group called enemy, and add, we'll do the same thing to our skeleton, enemy. One example is, if an enemy hits our player, we want to know that that's an enemy before we go on. So, I have an area 2D setup in our player. I could check if body dot is in group, and I'll type in enemy, and I could print out is enemy. Now for press play. I can interact with any one of these, and it will always detect that it's an enemy. We could also do group function calls, which means that we can call the same function on every member of that group. So if I go ahead and add a script to both of my enemy nodes, and let's say if the player steps on a stick, we want to alert the enemies that the player is present. So we'll create a new function called alert, and we'll just print alert mode. And let's go ahead and put the same function onto our phantom node. Back in our main scene now, I have a stick and our player. The player has a area check to detect the stick. And now to call the group function, we will get tree dot call group call enemy. And we will call that alert function that we created earlier. Now we press play and I step on the stick. You'll see that three enemies are in alert mode. We can also store every instance of a node inside of a group into a variable. So we can create a variable called enemies and we'll set this to get tree dot get nodes in group enemy. And also make sure that this is on ready. And this will act just like any other array. So we can type four, let's say E in enemies. And we're going to print e dot name. Press play. And we'll get a list of all of our enemies. Anyways, guys, I hope you found this story helpful. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below. And don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you.